said you can't be bad on a budget. Like, what? Look at this. This dress was $25, and look how it just sits and fits and hits all the right spots. It is the elegance for me. Yes, this is a declutter haul, y'all. Tap in. Yes, girl. <laughs> What up, what up, what up, what up? It is Misha B back at it again with another video. Do me a favor and like and subscribe already. And let's get right into this video and why it's a little bit different. So I wanted to come on here and share with y'all my 100 days of no spending challenge that I'm doing with some of the ladies from book club. Specifically, I will not be spending any money on clothes, shoes, bags, jewelry, accessories, any of those such things. And I thought it would be really fun to come on here and actually do some decluttering by doing like some hauls with things that I already own. So before we get into the video where I'm like trying on these different clothes, I wanted to kind of explain my thought process and why I went along with this 100 day no spend challenge. And although of course it's going to help me out financially, that wasn't necessarily the intention behind it more so about having space and less distractions in my space um, as I move forward through life. As you all keep hearing me say, I want freedom. I wanna be free and quite frankly, material things sometimes keeps us tethered to, to certain places. And I wanna just be able to move um, and have a life that's full of things that are meaningful, that bring joy, or serve a practical purpose. Because child, when I mean I was on here playing myself with some of these things in my closet that still have tags, it makes no sense. But enough of me talking, let's go into the video and we'll come back here to kind of finish up, wrap up, hear some thoughts, but I'm hoping that you can take from this, kind of seeing what you can do in your closet, and even and more importantly, spending your money on things that matter. So maybe you can do a 10 day challenge or a 20 day challenge. Maybe it doesn't have to be the full 100 days, but what's something that you can cut down on in terms of your consumption? That can also save you some money. So let's get straight into it. First, clearly, we have to get the close up of your girl before we start off. But I'm just wearing like a white tee. Let me take off this necklace. Can we even see like the full outfit? No, you can't. So I don't even know how to like properly get this angle. So I have to bring it down. Baby, are you down, 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 down. I was supposed to like flip it, but I feel like I'm not doing that either. So y'all will just get from the neck down. Pretty much, basically. Hey y'all, so we are learning and going through this together. I'm trying this on. We finally made it happen. Oh, look at the little booty shake. Ooh. Okay, so this was actually an outfit given to me by my grandmother. It is a suit, a suit skirt that is super cute and very obviously meaningful because of where it comes from. So this is a, ideally something that I would want to keep. As I showed before, the skirt is a little loose. The jacket itself too is a little big. So this is something that I would need to bring to a tailor to get it, you know, to fit towards my body the jacket is so cute though like it's giving me you know 80s vibes businesswoman professional in this beautiful green oh my goodness yes but in this uh and here we are all buttoned up this is giving me teacher stop talking in class yes spin around girl Woo! i'm loving this this is definitely a keep something that brings joy happiness and obviously has beating uh oh what wine with it little long but super cute and we're keeping this we love it so here's another one out of grandma's collection child as we see we are giving super cute vibes these are a pantsuit gray fits my body great i'm very comfortable super breathable and i'm just feeling all of it look i'm looking at myself in the mirror child because i think i look cute because i do yes look at the chocolate and oh oh Girl, you know you got to do the, the bend down test. See how I could bend down. <laughs> Yo, I'm funny as hell. Okay, so now we're going to put on the jacket. This is from Talbot's, uh, made years ago, obviously, if my grandmother gave it to me. As we put this on, we see another, um, you know, suit jacket. Ooh, ooh, wait a, wait a minute. Yes, mama, let me see you walk. 
ah, giving life. Yes, with the model pose. So it is a little big. Another piece that I need to get tailored at the top, but like I'm loving all of this again. Walk, in. walk, walk, walk. Yes, spin. What? And look at the hair, y'all. Don't forget the hair. So clearly we are keeping this. Love it. Okay, girl. Like, hold on. Uh, yes. Oh my gosh, girl. So uh, I got to replay this because like I just look so good. Let's let's add this clip so I can actually give the commentary because right now I just the beauty It's the beauty for me. So I actually got this from H&M back when I was a broke grad student. It was like $25 and this is definitely a keep all these years later. It still looks good and I can slay it at work again giving teacher realness. Another thing is you can dress this up or make changes to it. You know add a little sweater. Bam. There you go we're keeping this we're keeping it it's kept period like come on oh oh okay so now we're giving high fashion teacher slash i'm going out to brunch right after it one question though what's a waste y'all what is a waste yes as you see it fits my body beautifully this is giving all the joy and happiness yes so this is something that is going to be kept like, look at the booty okay booty me <laughs> Uh, but this actually was a piece that I bought from Shein, which was probably no more than $15. It's a size medium, so it's a little bit bigger than what I t typically wear as a small, but it's giving me all the feels. I feel good. I look good as I should, and we got to keep it because it's giving me all the good, you know, all the good feels. And it's super practical, right? I can go from work to go out for, you know, out for drinks with friends once we open up. Look, I'm practicing right now. Oops, drop something. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, we ready to go out right after work. Bam. Gotta keep it. It has multiple functions. And I look like a baddie. I'm here for it. My mama and Martin would say, you go girl. Oop. Okay, now we done switch up the vibes. We are going straight out for drinks. What's work? What's the job? Nope. Yes, this dress is everything. I got it from Forever 21 when they were going out of business in a store near me. It was $7. Yes, jiggle, 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 jiggle. Okay, girl, come on. Let's get it. Oops, saw a little jiggle though. Ah, let's get it together. Okay, anyway. This dress is super comfortable. It is super soft. It is one of my favorites. You can wear it in the fall. It has a little Slidiana thing going on with some high um, black boots is what I typically do. And also, you know, you can wear it in the winter too. Like it's just very multi-seasonal. Again, very practical, very cute. We are definitely keeping this because whenever I feel like I need a confidence boost or I need to remind myself of like this body yaddy yaddy, throw on this dress. I actually did the busted challenge in, in this dress. I might put it in this video. Probably not though because yeah. But anyway, why didn't y'all tell me that this was going to have my legs burning, this this um, busted challenge? Like, come on, we need to do better. But anyway, we're getting away from the purpose of the video. So let's move on to the next dress, which is another one from Grandma's Collection. So here we are. This is another dress that was given to me by my grandmother, and it's the color for me, y'all. It looks so beautiful on my skin. It is a little bit big. So this is another one that I'd have to take to be tailored. But like if you look at the color contrast between my skin and that black and tan brown color in the dress, oh my freaking goodness. It's something so like beautiful about this to me. So this isn't something that I would typically wear. However, like I am just in love with the look. I feel like it's giving elegance and class. I feel like there's a certain esteem to it um, when I'm wearing it. And this is definitely a keeper. Again, it has its sentimental purposes, but it looks beautiful. And now it's giving real unprofessional. Like clearly I didn't know what I was doing, y'all, but it'll get better. <laughs> so here we're back kind of in this realness of I can go to work or I can go to, for drinks after. This was another Shein buy, like $10, super cute. Another uh, medium. Again, when I go to work, I'm not trying to be like, you know, painted on, but booty looks good Ew, for those after work hours. This is the keeper. I love this dress and it's everything. So here we are. This dress is cute. I can wear it to work. I usually wear it with a cardigan and some, um, you know, tights and leggings and some high knees uh, boots. It's cute, but it's not giving me the same excitement and joy as the other things, nor does it have the sentimental value. So I think this one I'm going to donate to someone to use. It's super comfy, and again, it is cute, but it's not something I wear often enough, and I just feel like it has to go in the declutter pile. Bye! 
Okay, y'all, so welcome back. That is our haul. As you see, I'm putting things back on the hangers because nobody wants to deal with that mess. But this one, of course, is one of my faves. I am going to bring it to the cleaners sometime in February to get it fitted or to a tailor just because, like I said, this means a lot. It was my grandmother's. Um, she's still alive, so nothing like that. But it does have sentimental value because, you know, it's important to me. These rings are from my aunt, which is super important. So now I just need to get something from my mom for real. And then I can harness the power and the brilliance and the strength of the matriarchs in my family, y'all. Be out here with a power suit like bam. So yeah, um, take a look in your closet. Try things on. It was actually quite fun. I ended up, I ended up getting caught up in that gray dress, trying to do the busted challenge, y'all. Why didn't y'all warn me that it was a workout? And maybe I'll put a clip in here. Maybe I won't. But definitely go through your stuff. See what you need. See what you don't need. And get rid of things. Like I said, material things can sometimes clutter our minds, not just our space. And you are worthy of a clean space. You are worthy of a space where you feel comfortable. That allows your thoughts and emotions to come in and also go out. So in the meantime, in between time, consider taking on a no-spin challenge and stick to your budget the best way. Peace, 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 peace. Bye, y'all. Artlist.io.